take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. You will not be eligible to donate blood or platelets if you have tested positive for hepatitis B or hepatitis C, lived with or had sexual contact in the past 12 months with anyone who has hepatitis B or symptomatic hepatitis C. Make your mark, take our lead. You should not give blood if you have AIDS or have ever had a positive HIV test, or if you have done something that puts you at risk for becoming infected with HIV. You are at risk for getting infected if you have used needles to take any drugs, steroids, or anything not prescribed by your doctor in the last three months. Let's help you make your mark. Cancer survivors of blood cancers are ineligible to donate platelets due to the nature of their disease. If you have survived a solid tumor type of cancer, you are encouraged to look into donating platelets as the need for platelet donation is great.16 June 2020. Let's help you make your mark. You will be denied if your blood tests positive for HIV-1, HIV-2, human T lymphotropic virus, HTLV, I, HTLV-2, hepatitis C virus, hepatitis B virus, West Nile virus, WNV, and T pallidum, syphilis. Blood donation is actually a quick and easy way to get tested for all of these things. Point six January 2015. Take our lead. The American Red Cross require a 12-month waiting period after receiving a tattoo in an unregulated facility before a person can donate blood. This is due to the risk of hepatitis. Hepatitis is a type of liver inflammation. People who get tattoos in regulated and licensed facilities do not need to wait to give blood. 18 March 2020. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.